Yena Anton Budijic, Solenement Nahlev, in cum Casseu Pedidio Coloiali, in il Coflu Repubblica da Malta, o il Costituzione Taha e Calleaini. l'artiklu u jihad t-menin tal-prostituzzjoni ta' man jitrof illi kullmita jikun jemlok għal-ħatra ta' prim-ministr il-president ta' man għandu jahtar għala prim-ministru il-membru tal-kamra ta' t-deputa li t-gjedittu tija jikun laħja jikun jista jgawdi l-appoċ tal-maġġuranta tal-membri ta' dik il-kamra Issa għalek jiena Anton Budigi, President ta' Malta, bil-saħħa ta' s-setat mortijin li jintemmi artiklu għiħet t-menin tal-Kostituzjoni ta' Malta dan naħtar dilek onorevoli t-menta għala t-menin. Kuti t-aċċetta tal-ġintali. Mela senatik ġurament tal-li għalda nabit l-ġurament Jena għakta mintok sull-element naħlet l-inkun taħsaw t-tid l-li għali bejn l-poplu u l-Republika ta' Malta l-Konstituzjoni ta' ek għalla jeng spent a lot of time uh, in politics and the biggest thing that I've learned over the years and the decades is to say uh, a word or two in as many languages as I can because it represents a true picture of what Ontario is. It's a beautiful garden filled with many many different types of flowers but they all look beautiful when they're together and that the only thing that we ever have to worry about is those weeds <laughs> and from time to time we need to pluck the weeds out to let that garden be as beautiful as it always is. And so today is no different than the many days I've had the opportunity and the privilege to stand in front of a nation of people that have come from around the world to join our beautiful garden and to be a part of that garden. And the Republic Day is a great day to celebrate. And we should raise your flag. We should be proud. That's what Canada does. 
and 275,000 people every single year choose from around the world to come to Canada. That's amazing when you stop and think about it for just a moment. 275,000 people from around the entire globe choose Canada. And 125,000 of those choose Ontario. And some people call that the multicultural experiment of the world. And I'm here to tell you today the experiment's over. It's a great success because we've learned how to come together, work together, play together, raise our families together, and respect your home country and stay connected to your home country. So, Consul General, I thank you for being that connection and the capacity that you bring from the old country to the new country and your love of this country. You work hard. You play hard. You raise your families here. But you still stay connected to a great country. And we have to be respectful of that and recognize that when we do come here, we play together in this garden. And that those that would break the garden down need to go. And I say to you that I've never had to say to the Maltese people, go. Because you came here with a true determination to be a part of this great nation, this great province. So today we're celebrating your Republic Day. And so, Mr. Consul General, if you would be so kind as to accept on behalf of all of the members of the legislature, in celebration of Malta's Republic Day, it is my great pleasure on behalf of the Ontario Legislature to send you our heartfelt congratulations for this very important occasion. Congratulations, and when we raise that flag, stand proud, stand tall for both Malta and Canada. Congratulations. Hey, well said. I was thinking us here today. It's a true honor for all of us to be here. It's a true honor for me. This is my, my first uh, Republic Day in, in Canada, and it's a, a good way to start. Uh, I think it's a very, very suitable way to start. It's a, nice to be in, a, in such a, a, an auspicious um, environment, and I'm glad that so many people from the community have come. So thank you again for hosting us. I really do appreciate that. Um, Republic Day is, a, is our 40th anniversary. We've had a number of holidays this year. We've had Independence and Republic, and and it's good that this brings the communities together. And it is important that the communities stay together that they work together and that we and that we as a community continue to thrive in places like Toronto uh, you are you are our ambassadors you are the people that prove what Malta is worth so uh, we're all proud of you and uh, and uh, I hope you're proud of us and and uh, let us all um, uh, celebrate Republic Day together today with a flag raising thank you again and uh, thanks to the MC who's doing a great job uh, I, I promise that one. <laughs> Thank you, and thanks to Joe as well. He's back as well. Thank you. Thank you.
community as a federation we represent the clubs and the associations including St. Paul's Church that is the focus of our community and the, uh, the uh, Moses community area. Um, uh, the people that came here today they are proud, not only proud of being here in Canada but also of the origin where we come from. There was a great speech that you made for us, uh, Mr. Speaker, downstairs, where Canada lets us uh, bring our culture with us, integrate the, the Canadian fabric, and yet still be able to carry our traditions and our, our culture with us. It's, a, it's one, I think, of the only countries in the world that has been able to make that as a fabric of Canada. We thank you very much. I thank all of you for coming here representing the uh, community and uh, we hope that we keep growing as a community and also be of uh, uh, a source for, to Canada of uh, our wealth that we bring with us. I, uh, I do want to uh, wrap up so that we can get to know each other a little bit but I just wanted to announce that I was baking all morning. <laughs> water and bread. I wanted to do a little bit more than that. Uh, but I also will commit to you, uh, Council General, as long as you and I are together in this post, your post and my post, um, we've got a place to have our flag raising every year. Thank you very much. So thank congratulations you. and thank you. Enjoy yourself. Please. Thank you.